copies fight. of each other. They are carbon copies of each other. They both no. Oh wow. They okay, kind of look on the second. same as well. I thought Something there was a touch of gloves. <laughs> Randall Grewal in the red. Abdul in the blue. Coming from a Bushu background. Oh, that's a nice left hook of his own. Does Nanda oh. tries to trip him? Unfortunately, the cage was in the play. Both fighters jockeying from for control. Up to the Oh, that's and a nice knee there. Oh, big slam by Narendra Greval. In the mount, but he needs to be careful. Abdul Azim has a guillotine choke. It looks tight from this point. It looks but really it tight, tight from this angle. You can see Alan Fernandez screaming instructions. The dynamite is fighting back though. No, but this is this is great technique being shown by both the fighters. You can see Narendra is defending yeah. it the right way. He tried to pass to side control, switch up positions, and there you go. Abdul lets go of the guillotine. Narendra now looking for some ground and pound. He got the mount. Narendra in his last fight took on uh, Soro Ismail. He won that fight in devastating fashion. His only loss is actually to Irfan Khan, who fights right after this fight. So the winner of this fight, actually, it, it can be quite interesting. He might get his rematch. The next matchup, yeah. Looking for some ground and pound was Narendra. Great control so far. Up Just a lot of uh, toss and turn going on at the moment. Definitely a lot of loud action compared to the, the women's fight earlier. Both fighters jockeying for position. Up to trying desperately to flip him over. Oh, look at this. He's looking for an inverted guillotine. Uh oh, this is a bad position for Narendra Greval. It doesn't look very comfortable uh, for Abdul either. He's got him in a side neck Mind choke. Face, I think he's got it in tight. His trainer screaming at him to be patient. Beautiful side headlock and he reverses the position. Great defense shown by Narendra Greval as he transitions into the mount. Trying to land some elbows. Taking his time. Minute 50 seconds remaining in round number one. Great job by Abdul. Not allowing Red Narendra to posture up straight and land some heavy strikes. Look at the flexibility of this guy. He's... Wow. Oh, that's wow. a great <laughs> He's trying to grab a hold of a leg there. Oh, and he misses it. Great start to round number one. On, guys, Both action. these bantam baits are so talented. Narendra showing some great. So Abdul's got a bring it on attitude as well. I don't know right. what happened earlier. So he's taking to a walk in the park move. <laughs> well, this oh nice high kick landed by Narendra, but Abdul just ate it, and he keeps coming forward. Great chin displayed by Abdul. Narendra now, he's trying to push, trying to get that single on Narendra. But Narendra is not having any of it. Good sprawl. Trying to uh, circle around and get his back. You can see Alan Fernandez screaming out instructions. He's already losing his, his voice now. Beautiful. Beautiful move, turned around, oh, beautiful! Look at that, 10 seconds remaining. He's got the choke locked in. Can he finish it? 
He may just Five do seconds it. remaining. Oh, and it's saved it. by the, the bell. bell. <laughs> wow, what a great round corner, number one. Corner, great corner. Wow. Saved by the bell indeed. Abdul Azim. Look at the replay here. They open up striking. Both fighters land equally. Beautiful slam by Narendra Greval here. Tossed him over his head. He spent a lot of time in the mount position. Landed some good ground and pound, but nothing significant. He got out of a few precarious positions. Abdul had some strikes on him. Uh, had some submissions, excuse me. He had him in a guillotine once, but he ends the round with just a couple of seconds remaining in a tight rear naked choke. I think that's the kind of matchup that you look forward oh, wow. to. Don't no, you? I, I, I just wonder, if there was a couple seconds of more out. seconds, it could have been so different. Wipe him down, wipe 30, him down. 27 in the favor of Narendra Greyball. Well, wipe him down quickly. I'm kind okay. of glad because it takes it to the next round. I want to see more of this. Let's see, yeah. I, I'm, we move on to round number two of this exciting contest. Time! Fighter, ready? Both fighters ready. look ready. Fight! Both fighters look in great condition. For the viewers just joining us, Abdul Azim in the blue trunks, Narendra Greval in the red trunks. Abdul's from Afghanistan, who said he's fighting here to make his country proud. Well, he has a chance to make his country proud by beating. Oh, oh. nice knee by Narendra. Well, that was a low blow. These transitions are incredibly fast. Straight into side control is uh, Narendra Greval. No, as I was saying, uh, Azim, for his debut, is taking on quite the veteran. Narendra, apart from his loss to Irfan, has not lost in the SFL. He's proven to be dominant on more than one occasion and has really shown vast improvements in his game. Not only is he dangerous standing, he's also become a huge threat on the ground. You can see that he's trying to get an arm triangle choke. See the way he... Right now he's in mount. He needs to cross over to his right-hand side. Oh, he had it for a moment. He's trying to get it again. I think I somebody lost, lost the mouth, mouth guard. Oh, he loses that. He was looking for the arm triangle choke there a second ago. Mind the top, red corner. But I do like the fact that red, they both the are very the quick in their transition. Their moves are quicker. Red once now, the lighter weight classes will always be more technical, faster. Agile. It's always interesting to see fighters like these because fighters like Narendra just grow so quickly. He's like a sponge. You see him one month, you see him today, you see him a month later, he will be a completely different fighter. He's already shown incredible growth and progress in his ground game. His striking was always top notch. He landed some good strikes and he's showing he's landing some good ground and pound here. Oh, big elbow. Wow. Trying to trap that arm of Abdo. Abdul Azim trying to defend intelligently. He needs to scoot his hips out and get back to full guard. Oh, he gives up the mount again. Good job, Narendra Greval. Holding on to that mount. But see the flexibility of this guy. Stupid. He's got the mount. Narendra has the mount on him. He still pulls his legs back up and tries to get out of it. It's definitely an interesting watch that these guys bring. Come on, guys. Abdul Azim doing a good job, not Hold. allowing Narendra. Yeah, yeah. Look on a good gum shield. Hold. Oh. Red. Referee helps uh, <laughs> Actually, Abdul with the, with the mouth guard. Puts back the mouth guard. Good base shown by Narendra Greval, not allowing Abdul to uh, buck his hips and try and reverse the position. There he goes again. He's trying to shake him off, but Narendra's base is so good. He's been training with uh, fighters like uh, Alan Fernandez, who and is India's only purple belt in Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu. So you know his ground game is improving. And Rajbir Singh from the Wushu Academy Up. brings a good Minute training partner. Minute and a half left in uh, round number two. Referee Ryan Thorpe stands up, both fighters, they reset. Abdul Azim 
showing some great defense on the ground. Did not allow. He's trying to go for oh! a takedown, but look at this. He needs to be wow. careful here. Abdul has oh. a guillotine locked in. Beautiful slam, but he needs to be careful here because that looks like a tight guillotine. It's like change of strategy mid air. Nice. No, usually it's quite dangerous in the air. It's if a fighter locks on a guillotine and fighter B tries to slam him down, that actually helps fighter A to get Come on, guys, a stronger action. grip. I don't think it's too tight Red, put your gum at this it. point. Narendra staying patient. Not really uh, concerned about the guillotine Red, anymore. Red, Twenty seconds remaining in uh, round number one. Abdul trying to wall walk. For a moment there, I thought he is trying to flip him over. Abdul say uh, walking around was his favorite pastime. <laughs> if that helps. Let's go of that guillotine. Come on, guys. Ten seconds remain in round number one. And I think they're going to end, Stop. and they do. They end up in this position. What a great fight. Nando Greval showing some real good all-round skills in that round. Abdul Azim showing some great defense, some great reversals. You look at the replay here. At this point, Narendra had top position. He was in mount on more than one occasion. Abdul defended really well. This is the end of the round where I really thought Abdul had that guillotine locked in. It that looked was quite the interesting move. Yeah, and Narendra just slammed into the ground and got out of it. 30-27 again in the favor of Narendra Greval. Round number two goes to Narendra. Seconds out. Seconds out. Here we go at the start of Out round number seconds, three. Out. Final instructions at both corners. Abdul looks ready to go. As does his uh, opponent, Narendra Greval. Fighter ready. Ready. Fight. Here we go. Round number three. Abdul takes the center. Oh, nice leg kick landed by Narendra Greval there. Certainly the pressure of the two fighters. They both Narendra. are quite charged up. Both fighters swinging for the fences. Whoa! Slam! Oh, that was Beautiful awesome. slam into side control by Narendra Greval. That was a head slam. That <laughs> ought to hurt. Oh, yeah. That, believe me, Supri, that hurts. <laughs> Trying to land some nice elbows looking. Oh, straight into the mouth. No, sorry. That's half guard. Trying to get into the mount. Oh no, wait a minute, that's mount. Sorry, ladies and gentlemen. He just didn't have the right angle. In mount position. Looking to uh, tie up Blue. a submission, perhaps. Trying to get that. Oh, for a moment there, he was looking for a triangle. He needs to be careful. Abdul in top position, trying to land some ground and pound. Abdul needs to be careful of Narendra's up kicks. He did counter that uh, submission attempt beautifully. In the guard of Narendra Greval is uh, Abdul Azim. Great job by both fighters. But out of the two fighters, Narendra has really been impressing me tonight, Supreet. He's shown so much improvement overall. He's going to be really a, a, a real force in this division. Only if you're at the uh, judges' table right now. <laughs> The shot looked like it landed on the back of the head. It's actually quite beastly the way these guys are at it. Both fighters fighting for that position. Abdul might be looking for... Uh -oh. He's going for a takedown again. Nanda's got him down. He's looking for that guillotine again. Oh, and he, he gave it up. Content to stay here Mind in the, uh, the guard is uh, Abdul. And the passes. Oh, look at that. 
effortlessly, effortlessly. He passed to half guard, straight into the mount again. It just changes every few seconds. Oh, great reversal by Abdul. And back again. This is, this is crazy. Mount, side control, mount, side control. <laughs> yeah, Abdul, Narendra, Abdul back on. Now Narendra's on. So. <laughs> Two and a half minutes action. remaining in uh, the third and final round. Again, Narendra gets to the mount. Great defense shown again by Abdul. He's just not letting Narendra posture up. He's just not letting him posture up. He's not letting him no land holding, big strikes. He's been a good opponent for sure. Good reversal once again. But back to the ground they go. Narendra Greval in side control. Perhaps looking for a submission here. You can see beautifully done by Abdul. He pulls it back to guard. That just shows, this shows that these guys have been focusing on technique. They've been putting in the time in the gyms and it shows. Alan's asking him to finish it. Minute 25 on, guys, remaining attention. in this fight. But like I was saying, Shupri, they've, they've shown, they've shown vast improvements mm. in their technique, in their Mind the back composure, the everything. Both fighters are durable. And what a debut for this guy. Win, lose or draw, mm -hmm. Abdul Azim has nothing to be embarrassed about. Now this has definitely been a great matchup. Minute remaining in this fight. Look Look at that. Nice Narendra Nice elbows from Mind the bottom. The top of the head, low. By Not the top of the head. Referee warning uh, Abdul Azim for those elbows to the top of, uh, it looked like it was the back of the head, but I don't know, we need to check that out in the replay to see Come if on it was guys, legal. Action. Shots to the body, less than 30 seconds remaining in this fight. Narendra Greval content to stay in the guard. Ten seconds remaining in this fight. And it goes to the judges. And it goes to the judges. What a great fight so far. Great effort by both the fighters. So Great Come performance. Nandu Gaval and Abdul Azim. Well, the crowd is loving it. It doesn't matter what the decision is. It gave us a great fight today. It was a great fight. Both fighters poured their heart and soul into this fight. And what a great debut for the 19-year-old from Afghanistan. Impressive for sure. Look at the highlights throughout this fight. Beautiful slam. It looked like he landed on his neck and head. He seemed fine. This was the highlight of the fight. Narendra Greval in top position, controlling the posture, controlling the action throughout all the three rounds of this fight. Great performance and great defense shown by both fighters. Narendra for getting out of submissions and Abdul for avoiding heavy damage. And we go to the Twitter feeds. Shubro Matty at Shubro SFL. Hashtag SFL19 at the Fight League All-Star Fight Card. Don't blink, fireworks tonight. Irfan Khan at Irfan Khan SFL. Wrapping up. Time to get into fight mode. Catch me on Star Sports Live, 9 p.m. onwards at Super Fight League. Hashtag Inferno. What a great, great fight, ladies and gentlemen. Let's show it for the two fighters. And after three rounds, the judges scored the two fighters 30-27, 30-27, 30-27. Declaring the winner by the judges' unanimous decision in the red corner, Narendra Garevol!